Pretty good. You know, we like the tempo. I mean, that was the big thing is just getting them back out here, kind of getting in the kinks. It's the first time we've been out here uh, since spring. So just kind of get the kinks out and, um, you know, just kind of get back in the groove a little bit. But it was a good day. I like the tempo. I think really when you look after the first week, maybe first really two weeks until you get to that jersey scrimmage, because right these first couple of days, you're just installing. So you're just trying to get the offense taught and the defense taught uh, again. So you just want to continue to do that. But really after these first four days, because we got the first four days scripted already, and then we'll start getting into situations and things like that. Really, maybe five more days after that, you can kind of put pieces together and people to, together on who's going to help you and who's who's not. Wait until that period. I had to wait till period eight. <laughs> you know, uh, they won't let me do nothing till period eight. So um, I was trying to go. I was going to make the rest of them like four minutes long instead of five minutes. But but it's fun, and we'll get more and more. And and really, the reason that that I do it not only for that reason, but. Um, I've been there. I've had three guys I've had to coach and to take the pressure off of Coach Burrow so he can now only coach those two guys because that spot is one of its own. And you spend a lot of time in your meeting room as a safeties coach coaching that guy and you don't spend a lot of time with the safety. So um, it takes the pressure off of him a little bit that I can take them for individual and, and do things with him so he doesn't have to take time to do it. Well, last year I was here playing quarterback and I kind of saw where I was on the depth chart and I went to coach and said, Coach, where? is the best chance for me to get on the field. And he said, well, maybe you should think about moving to slot or wide out. And I said, OK, yeah, put me there. Because I just want to I just want to be anywhere to help the team win. Just, I just want to be on the field. I don't care where it is at all. It's a little harder than I thought, actually. Yeah, because I played a little receiver in high school. And obviously, the jump from high school to college is huge. So I had. I thought it would be a little easier than it was, actually. Yeah, it was, diff it was more difficult learning the steps, learning the routes. The speed of the game is different, obviously. It's just a, it's a different feel looking at coverages from the backfield than it is from the wideout slot. So yeah, it was diff it was more difficult than I thought it would be. But I was a, I liked the challenge. Um, it definitely felt better than it did last year moving, because when you play well, I played quarterback since I was like 10 years old. So when you play one position for so long and you switch, obviously it's going to be difficult when you're just first thrown in. But having a summer to work on routes, catching, timing, it's definitely easier. It was today than it was last year. It, I can definitely it feels different, feels better. We need some guys to step up in there, and he and he has been. He's had a great summer, um, so it's it's in his hands on you know how far he wants to take it. But um, you know I don't care who's out there. I just want the best guys out there, and he has a chance to to be one of those guys that can help us. Anything they want me to do, I'll go do. Right now I'm on um, punt return. I'm just back up on punt return, but I'll go anywhere. I'll play anything they want me to do. So I'm gonna whatever they need me to do, I'll go do it. But right now, yeah, I'm uh, back up on punt return. I'll try and go out there and earn the spot. <laughs>